I know the anticipation was waiting for me to do Elden Ring again. Thank you, thank you. So, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whatever time zone you're in. Welcome back to Elden Ring walkthrough. Now let's let the music play. I love that main music theme every single time. Does it go 100% hard like Dark Souls 3? Yes. As hard as uh, Bloodborne? Yeah, pretty much. Man, it's so great to get back to this game. It's been so long. Way too long. Okay, so this is not going back to my major one of the three big games I was doing pretty much before Saints Row the Third and Turrentus. I had to dedicate focus on that. No, it's not that. It's random day, and guess what random day it is? It's the E section day, so I know I can actually get done with the E section, because we're just doing one video per game before we put all the focus on Saints Row the Third. That, that's the goal for today. And over the week, maybe Saturday tentatively, but I think that'll be kind of like a break day. And then Sunday, we'll start the F section, but we'll probably do three games, because I really want to try to finish up Saints Row the Third Remaster before it comes out of PlayStation Plus on February 21st. Don't know what other game they're going to take around March, because now we kind of have to focus on the games that are going to be removed on PlayStation Plus. You know, before they put on PlayStation Plus for free on that, you know, the Essential package. That's kind of how it is. Oh, right. Now I remember where I was. Uh, basically the bear. I'm curious about the half-wolf. I, I am curious. I'll come back to that one. Right. The fort. That was the last place. Let's... M yeah, let's hurry to boarding. Yeah, that's exactly where I left off. Uh, yeah, let's make it boarding... Because we want to avoid the bear as much as I can. Because that bear is actually not as tough as the one bear near that lake. But it's pretty freaking tough. Alright, turret to me! And I miss Elden Ring too. I just got so focused on the other two games I wanted to finish before they got out of PlayStation Plus. I know I'll finish Saints Row the third pretty much this upcoming week too, even if I don't finish it. I'm gonna finish the main story campaign and then even if I don't finish all the kind of activities, as long as I finish the main story campaign, then I can walk away from Saints Row because I have the game technically on place well wait on the Xbox 360. Man, it's weird that I have that still. Wait, did I kill all the enemies? Did I liberate the fort? I guess I liberated the fort. Oh, nope, nope. They do respawn. Not that it means there any difference! You're all gonna die the same! Like last time! Hey, what's that sound? Oh, it's just a bunch of goblins. Come at me, bros. Oh, shut up. Trooper! Oh, well. 
I'm that tough that I can basically one-shot you guys like no one's business. Let's go! Goblin Slayer would be proud. Well, are you guys technically goblins? I love Goblin Slaver that... Uh, sorry, Slaver. Uh, Goblin... Goblin Slayer. That shows... That show is underrated. I know people might not appreciate it because of the slice of life that it takes after that that first episode, but I very much appreciate that show. I, I actually like its slice of life, and I like how it ended. I liked how it started, and I like how it ended. It's just that really underrated show that nobody's going to watch. Was it a show made for me? Absolutely not. But is it a show I enjoy? Yeah, I kind of do. I just know that no one's going to watch that show. Wait, wait. Besides Goblin Slayer, let's get back to Elden Ring. Oh, Elden Ring. That I haven't done for a while. Hmm. I haven't done that reference. It's kind of odd. Okay, um, I think I was supposed to do something at this fort. Yeah, I, I kind of like... Ah, there he is! Just like he said he would be. Um, what's in here? All right, that was the night I fought and killed and liberated this fort. So, I do want to do the Coliseum. I do want to do the Coliseum. Yeah, yeah. Probably after I get a certain amount of... After I get a certain progress, like I'm towards the end for Saints Row the Third, maybe I'll come back to Elden Ring after my random day. I'm going to try to do one video, but it's just... Elden Ring's just too damn good that I just can't not come back to it. I put 63 hours. I could change that. I think the longest that I've seen people do in their walkthroughs is 150 hours or more. There's just too much. I, I'm... Top, tops. By the time I get to the end, when that comes to Elden Ring, it's probably going to be up to 150 hours. Not all at once. Just It, it, it just collectively got me to 150 hours. And... What's the plan for Elden Ring? Of course, if there's a DLC, which I'm absolutely getting in the future, I'm going to, of course, do walkthroughs of that. But along with Elden Ring 2, I kind of want to do, like, a boss rush. So, try to do all the more story-based boss or the boss that were just too fantastic to pass off. That's... I'm going to probably do a marathon of that again. And I want to lock all the endings, because I know there's multiple endings, because that kind of started with demon souls in a sense but really the multiple endings the multiple endings started with bloodborne technically when i look back at the series history anyway ah you is it i suppose you must have seen it by now yes what the sorry state of my foot oh indeed it is a foul fate for a land to be without a ruler one must be found with haste and not that awful Godric, but a true and stalwart lord of the proper lineage to take the reins of Limgrave. I already killed Godric, so wait. Yeah, I already killed Godric. The dragon breathing dickhead. I remember him. I'm sorry to have lifted your hopes, but I haven't the authority to raise you to knighthood as things stand. The great Kenneth Height. Issues his sincerest apology. But now, I must begin my search post haste for a true and stalwart lord of the proper lineage to take the reins of Limgrave. Yeah, good for you. I didn't believe any BS you were spouting earlier before I even got to this board, but thank you. I must begin my search post haste for a true and stalwart lord of the I do not care! Okay, so now let's go to the beast side. And after that, we need to... Good freaking question. Where do I need to go? Oh, yeah, right. Oh, that area. That... Freaking area. Do I have to? That that area... I know what's over there. It's not fun. That area was terrifying. For good reason. It's not just terrifying, it's freaking hard. At my current level. Which is shocking. 
Okay, uh... One room. Oh, the Moon Moongrain. I already completed that area. So I already completed that. I think I did most of this area, too. Yeah. Okay, yeah, I did all that. And the Tower of Return. Where else do I need to go? Uh, good question. Huh. Yeah, that area is too hard, too. I fully explored this area. I Have I fully explored this area? Uh, yeah. The abandoned coffin. Oh, yeah. I remember that. Um, yep. Also a hard area, too. So this kind of leads me going to this area, which was really hard. I kind of have no choice. Well, anyway, let's go to... Uh, the beer's there, but it doesn't matter. All right, well, back to turret again. Huzzah! Okay, let's find the beast... this character. Guess I'm curious enough to meet this wolf character. Before we move to the harder areas, I'll pretty much... I'm gonna die every single time. Haha! <laughs> Yeah, you know why I'm able to one-shot these guys? I'll show you why. Freaking 90... Well, I guess interrupt that. Sure, whatever. I was monologuing. Frick. Let's go. Ow! The power of dodging! Nice try, though. Alright, cool. I don't really have to walk, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Okay, the bear was here last time, when it was dark and he was sleeping. Wait. Could the bear have changed locations? Because one time he was scratching at a tree and he was nearby. But he doesn't seem nearby this time. Wait. Son of a biscuit! You are actually here! We're gonna have to fight him sometime. Screw it! Wolves! Buy his... Buy his bear nuts up! It's time to die, you bear! Well, shoot. Wow, I totally messed up! Oh! Well, healing. Poke in the butt. Am I gonna say my vengeance screaming it? No. Vengeance! I mean, I didn't die to him. I mean, it seems inappropriate to say VENGEANCE! Yeah, I'm not putting enthusiasm into it. Wait, what's that? Howling. There's someone howling. There's someone absolutely howling. Hold on! 
Who's howling? What's up with this? Hold on. That bear wasn't tough. Not like the one on the lake. He was tough. Okay, come on. I heard howling. There's absolutely... Yeah, there it is. He's up there, isn't he? Alright, I'm very curious. Let's see what this is all about. Where are you, Wolfman? Seek up. No crap much. I want to meet the Wolfman. He's here. He's totally here. Just to require a head. How do we meet the Wolfman? Okay, he's clearly here. There's no way that they set this up. Wait, is he up there? Is he all the way up there? I might cheat and actually have to look this up because I'm curious about the Wolfman. I'm not gonna kill the muskrat, whatever that thing is. I'm not gonna kill the boars. I'm fairly friendly to. He's definitely here. He's all the way up there, isn't he? Wait! There he is! That's awesome! How did you get up there? Okay. Okay. Now I gotta look it up. I gotta look up how we're gonna beat this guy. Do I need some special gesture, or... How do I get this guy? Son of a biscuit. I knew he was here. All right, what you do? You're called Blade, even though that's kind of redundant. Blade the Half Wolf. Okay, so how do we get this guy? Hurt your vows, huh? Finger snap, huh? Okay, so that's how we start it. We need a finger snap gesture. Do I have a finger snap gesture? You know, I don't know. Hold on. Let's see if we have it. Okay, so we have to snap at him like a dog? I mean, he is a half human, half dog. Our spurby, the ejection. I do not have that. Okay, Merchant Kale. Merchant Kale. Where's Merchant Kale? Is he at the. Oh, there's a Merchant Kale. At the Church of Billy Elish. It, it's the. Church of Ella, but I like to call him Billy Ellis for some reason. Okay, so, uh, yeah. Now we gotta go to the Church of Vows. Because we killed the bear, and we were not supposed to kill the bear. Apparently. Where is the Church of Vows? I think I locked a grace point for it. Possibly. Gotta check. Yeah, I gotta double check. Hold on. Church of Vows. Church of Vow. Church of Vow. Do we need a vow? Name the letter of vow. Okay, cool. Ah, 
Ah, there, I did! Okay, cool. Okay, so... I killed the bear... And... Oh, the Pulp Turtle! Yeah, I remember that. Hey, Pulp Turtle! I'm gonna... Oh, I don't need Absolution. Okay. Pulp Turtle! Greetings. Do you need anything? Yes! Tea tree stuff! Oh, out of stock. Can't purchase anymore. Do I have one? I don't have a ticket anyway. Uh, incantation. What do we learn? Rad to God. <laughs> okay. Bye, Pulp Turtle! I guess I came here for nothing! It's great to see Pulp Turtle again. It just feels like it's been a while. Anyway. Uh, yeah, that's where we need to be. Wait, Kale. Who is Kale again? Kale, Kale. 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 Who is Kale? Kale. I'm trying to find out who Kale was because it's it's been so long. Merchant Kale. Oh right. I just looked it up too. It's this one. There we go. All right. Teach me the finger snap gesture so I can get the half human, half wolf man. It's you again. Always a pleasure. Care to purchase anything? We need to talk about information. About the howling. The howl of a wolf. Yes. In the mistwood. I suppose he must still be skulking about. I know. Why not meet him for yourself? Next time you hear the wolf's howl, make this signal right under the source. Oh, don't fret. There is nothing to fear. I just have an inkling the two of you might hit it off. Bye for now.
What is it? Still going to purchase something? Who goes there? Carly sent you, did he? Ever the bloody busybody. Hmm. Maybe to him you don't seem so strange. The name's Blythe. I'm looking for a man who goes by Darrow. He fled somewhere nearby. Or so I've heard. Come tell me if you find him before I do. I can offer you ample reward. Darrow is nothing but a traitor. ...and in need of a fitting end to his tale.
Darrowell is nothing but a traitor, and in need of a fitting end to his tale. Right. There you are. Not to work for it, but it's done. Don't say I'm not a man of my word. You're your prize. Oh, yes. I should say. If you venture north to Rea Lucaria and come across a venerable blacksmith who's a little on the large side, tell him I sent you, and he'll be sure to treat you right. I owe you one, I reckon. That's enough chit-chat for now. It's time we parted ways. That's enough chit-chat for now. It's time we parted ways. Thank you.